Thank you very much. Well, the wind that came with these storms mm -hmm. that blew through last night was so strong that it actually was able to knock over an RV. Yeah, two people were actually trapped inside that RV when it tipped over. They needed to be rescued. It happened at the RV park off of Kanaga Avenue near the Travis County Expo Center. And Kate has been there live with the very latest on the damage. Good morning. Yeah, certainly a scary night for the two people that were living inside this RV when it tipped over. We understand a man in his 70s at one point was trapped, was pinned in there by some furniture in the trailer itself. Thankfully, both the man and woman who were trapped are expected to be OK after firefighters were able to get them out. Now, it was right after the storm started around 2 this morning when authorities were called to this area because the strong wind flipped the RV. At first, there were reports the RV was partially submerged in water, but that turned out out not to be the case, thankfully. But in order to get the two people living inside out, firefighters had to cut a hole in the roof and move some furniture to free them. Both were transported Baylor Scott and White Medical Center for treatment. Authorities out here said they had significant but not life threatening injuries. And as we come back out live, you can see the RV, but also as we kind of pan to the left, you can see there are a lot of tree branches that are down. Uh, we were just talking to one resident out here who said that one, uh, the tree behind them actually split in half and thankfully fell the opposite direction of their RV. So they said they feel really lucky this morning. So residents, as they're waking up, are starting to see some of the damage, guys. I bet. Kate, thank you so much for that. The storms woke up a lot of people overnight and some of you were up and decided to take pictures and send it to us and so we have some of those for you this morning. Yeah, take a look at this. This is the Austin Yacht Club. That's the clubhouse. You see there a lot of uh, down branches and pieces of oak trees there. Fred Schroth sent us that picture. Thank you for that. And a picture of a fence that was blown down in Pflugerville. This is Dessal and Wells Branch. Thanks to our viewer, John. And also more lightning. Chantel Gibson shared us this with video. Look at those lightning bolts. If you have pictures and video that you want to share with us, we would love to see them. You can send them to report it at kxan.com.